Hong Kong was once a benchmark in luxury goods and service, and today it's still considered as one of the most sophisticated centers for international cuisines. And Bonnie Coxon, one of the most renowned socialite, or should I say, aristocrat in Hong Kong, has always been indispensable in bringing Hong Kong to the top echelon in this category. However, I remember in an interview with a magazine, Ms. Coxon once lamented how the luxury catering industry had to adapt to the ever-changing demand of the well-off customers. And one of the weirdest requests she's ever come across with was when she was asked to bring a bowl for the customer's phlegm. Hmm, disgusting. All right, enough of these disgusting things. Today, I'm taking you to the Sever, one of the cafes managed by Miss Goxon, to have their afternoon tea. First, let's talk about the best things about this afternoon tea, which is not related to the food itself. Because what's not to love about this alfresco dining area, where you can enjoy spectacular views of the Central District and the Victoria Harbour. And now the WTF moments, and that is the food. First of all, there is no scone, and then it's the amount of food they served. Three small and fluffy cakes of two persons, one small beef burger, one chocolate fudge shake that's nowhere near Miss Speed's bakery standard, not to mention Max Banner, a coffee that's only slightly better than the one served at the Starbucks, and the most WTF moment is this sad and curled paper. And surprise, it's a curled ham sandwich. Still, the food is not 100% disastrous, like the spring rolls. This chicken a la king tartlet, lobster salad, smoked salmon and caviar blini, and these boost cups. Overall, this is an okay afternoon tea, but for seven hundred twenty dollars for two, you would expect something better. That said, this alfresco dining area may have made up for the food's inadequacies. 